Hello, this is Nick with NicksComputerFix.com and here's a quick video on how to speed up Windows 7 and also how to speed up Windows 8.1. To start with, let's go ahead and do part one here, how to speed up Windows 7. Um, let's go ahead and go down here and click on our start menu. And on the command line here, type in msconfig and um, once you have the system configuration window open, go ahead and click on start or startup rather. And um, that brings up a list here of the applications that are running in the background and which start on your uh, boot up when you start your computer up. And if you see any applications or uh, programs that you don't want running in the background and using up valuable resources, uncheck them and uh, then click on apply and then click on OK. Now be sure not to uncheck any of the Microsoft programs that um, may need to be running in order for your computer to run correctly. So uh, be smart about um, which ones you're unchecking. But once you do uh, decide, you just go ahead and click on OK and um, exit without restart. I'm going to click on that because I don't want to restart right now. Moving on to part two, how to speed up Windows 8.1. Okay, once you're on the Windows 8.1 start screen, let's go ahead and get started by adjusting your startup programs. These are programs that are not necessary to be running in the background. Okay, the way we do that is we go to our task manager, and the first way to get there is to hit your control shift uh, escape key on your keyboard or use your mouse and move the cursor up to the top here and click on the search button and we're going to go ahead and type in the word task manager and then we'll scroll down and click on task manager and that brings up the task manager window if you don't see more details click on more details and then we are able to go ahead and see the startup tab and we want to go ahead and click on that and this gives you the list of programs that are presently running um, when you boot up your computer and some of them are not necessary to run and we can right click and click on disable to disable them now keep in mind you don't want to disable um, certain programs like your uh, virus protection software and uh, Microsoft system applications that are running Okay, that's it for this video presentation. Subscribe and like my video.